Hey guys, what's up? Creative Heroes 2006 here. This time my first ever showcase video and I am so excited for this one because this is Aquaman. Now, Aquaman, I don't know about you guys, a lot of you might disagree, but this was movie of the year for me. I loved it. I have not seen Bumblebee yet. I hope uh, Aquaman doesn't change its title, but this movie was amazing. Again, what I said with Spider-Man, if you don't plan on seeing Aquaman, change all those thoughts immediately and go see it. You are gonna love it. Now, for this showcase video, I got Aquaman and Mira. Ignore me on, on the middle. That I'm gonna be showing myself in every LEGO showcase video I've got. But, uh, without further ado, let's get started on Aquaman. So, Aquaman, I'm really sorry about the lighting, it looks a little dark, I want to say it's meant to look like that, but it's actually not, but, Aquaman, I was having a thrill of a time, I was having so much fun doing this figure, everything except for the face and hair is 100% painted by me, the Triton kind of annoyed me with Legos because it came dark silver in a gunmetal color, but, um, I really do think I improved upon it, um, I did use it because it had the three spikes instead of the five, That, um, but um, I really do think this looks amazing. I really do like that detail right there that I did with the arm. You can see right there that I do think that came out pretty darn awesome. I did do the green all, all the way, but I did not do the black all the way, unfortunately. But I did uh, add these highlights. I, I'm pretty darn sure he's supposed to have them in the movie. I don't know. But uh, the A was hand-painted by me. The belt, the muscles, and the all the highlights here were 100% painted by me. I don't really know how many times I'm going to be saying it, just to make it clear. But the Triton, again, was painted by me in a, gold, in a gold paint. I didn't really add anything on the back, because his, uh, most of his hair would be covering it. I wasn't trying to be lazy, but I didn't paint the back of the legs either, because, you know, they could be useful for another custom, maybe next time. Uh, that gold is fading away, uh, sadly, but you can see there is some side details right there, as you already noticed, and this one is, maybe it's a little more clean. But, um, yeah, the legs, I think, came out pretty darn awesome. And, um, yeah, the, I used all my metallic colors for his suit. And, uh, other than that, I think we're done with Aquaman. I think that's pretty much it for my custom Lego Aquaman, and I forgot to show the top of the Triton, but there it is if you guys... I uh, really want to see it, but other than that, let's move to Mira. I'm really sorry about the lighting on the right arm, guys, but other than that, the Mira, I pretty much grabbed Lego's Mira and just improved upon it. Um, everything, the back is pretty much the same, um, the the tor the legs and the torso are pretty much the same, except I did add some details on the boots so that it could look more like Mira's costume, and I did add some arm detail to Mira, which I think came out pretty cool. I know in the first trailer, uh, her costume looks more metallic green, kind of like, um, um, Aquaman's over here looks more metallic green and stuff, but um, I do think that the turquoise, I did see more turquoise than green in the movie, I'm pretty sure I only saw one part that was green in the movie, but I decided to stick with the turquoise, um, and I was not trying to be lazy again, but I really do think that looks like the uh, Mira's suit in the movie, but um, what I did improve on, uh, uh, what I did improve upon on is Lego's hair, because originally I was gonna stick with Lego's hair, and then I just realized how not terrible, but how not good that hair actually looked on Lego's, I'm sorry about that, um, but uh, I did improve upon it, and I did uh, paint it red, that the paint is fading off a little bit, so that's kind of bad, but really, uh, I know this was a kind of a short video, not really, but, um, I know it was a short little segment for Mira, but that's all I got to say for her. Let's end this video. So, guys, again, thank you so, so much for staying here with me through the whole thing. I really do like it when you guys stick with me here in this YouTube channel and make it all the way through these videos. So, uh, other than that, we'll just call it a day. Subscribe if you haven't. Uh, smash that like button, please. Comment down in the video what you thought about Aquaman and what you think about this review. But other than that, I really did enjoy making this review and I really did enjoy making these figures. My next review will be a pretty exciting one for me, my second throwback episode. But, without, but other than that, 
Thank you guys for, uh, for watching. Subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.